Yo, what's going on out there, guys? It's Roll Easy here, and I'm back with another GTA 5 Online video. And this one, we're going to be doing, I would say, the fastest and best gift cards to friends I think I've ever done, to be honest with you. It's right up there if it's not. Now, a shout out to Joseph and Aaron for figuring this one out. This one is mad simple. I mean, the other one I posted is pretty easy, but this one's even quicker. Instead of getting a second alert, all you need is the first alert, okay? Now, you do need a friend to help you out, but it's mad easy. So, what you're going to need for this glitch is you do need a full facility. Make sure it's filled up with RH8s or whatever vehicles that you want to overwrite. And you need a streetcar, okay? Your friend can actually just buy a jerry can from ammunition. You see the jerry can I'm holding? Have a jerry can from ammunition. Make sure when you're using it, you don't like fully run out because then you have to go over and get another one. So what I recommend doing is just going, just like filling it back up in your inventory in the ammo section, and you want to go ahead and just fill it up before it runs out. Okay. So you see what I'm doing right here? I'm just pouring gasoline all over uh, Lost Glitch's car. So shout out to uh, BMXer and Lost for helping me make this video. Now you see how I'm only pouring it on the hood? This is before we realized that you can actually do this very quickly. So at first, you see, we were waiting for like the tires and stuff to catch on fire. All right. So right now he just, he's at his facility. He pulled up with a streetcar to get the fuller. So he's sitting on the fuller right now. All right. And what you want to do is actually pour gas all over the top of the car. I'm talking all over the hood, the roof, the trunk, everything. Pour it all over and then just shoot at the car and make sure it's completely on fire, just completely engulfed, okay? Once that car is completely engulfed, you tell your friend to accept the alert. Okay, so we're shooting it, the car is on fire, we're gonna go ahead and tell Lost right now to accept the alert and then open up the interaction menu and kill himself. Okay, that's literally it. So he accepted the alert right now, and then boom, you see, he took the easy way out, as you can see in the bottom left. And guess what, guys? That's it. He's actually fully glitched out. Now, all I got to do is get the vehicle that I'm giving him, and I just got to put it over there at the yellow circle, all right? So it does suck sometimes that the whole, you know, area kind of catches on fire, but that's literally all he had to do. So you see that? He just gets the, we just get the car fully engulfed in flames. You know, you shoot the gas, or you shoot the, uh, the gas lines. You know the little trail of gas that's on the car just to kind of completely make sure it's on fire once it's completely on fire tell him to accept the alert tell him to open up the interaction menu and take the easy way out and that's it all right so he's running over there and look at this he's just gonna hop onto the vehicle i'm getting him he'll get the full alert and then he just accepts it and boom he just went into his facility with my vehicle that simple guys okay i'm gonna show you from my perspective just in case you know i mean you can't really see much obviously but this is what you're doing so just grab a streetcar. I have a full facility. It has vehicles in there. I don't mind overriding. And I'm just going to go ahead and drive up and get the full alert. He has his jerry can ready to go. Remember, do not fully run out or else you have to go to ammunition and buy another one. So just make sure you fill it up in your inventory and in your interaction menu before it actually goes empty. Okay. So right now, I'm just going to drive up to my facility with a streetcar right now and get the full alert. Okay. Any second now. I should be driving up now. Okay. So... Once I drive up, th what they're going to be doing while I'm on the black screen, just pouring gas all over the top of the car, okay? So right now, that's what they're doing. He's on the hood. He's pouring gas all over the hood. He's pouring gas on the roof, and he's pouring gas on the trunk, okay? The car is in God mode, but for some reason, the fire acts differently, okay? Just the fire, just for some reason, lets you accept the alert without actually getting sucked in to the facility all right so once the car is completely engulfed in flames they're gonna tell me i'm gonna go ahead and accept the alert and then you can get out of the car if you really want to you don't have to but then open up your interaction menu and just take the easy way out so you see i accepted it nothing happened open up interaction menu boom ewo just like that guys so you see that and uh yeah it says bmx or killed me i think that's the new little ewo thing that they put in the script in the new update but yeah, that's how you get glitched out now, guys. That is literally it. So right now, I'm actually just waiting for Lost to go ahead and call up a vehicle. As you can see, the whole field kind of catches on fire. But I'm glitched out, and I'm ready to receive a car. That's all you need to do, all right? Your friend just needs to completely pour gas all over the car. Once it's completely on fire, they let you know. You accept the alert. You can get out of the car or stay in it. Doesn't matter. And then just open up the interaction menu. Take the easy way out. That is it, okay? So it can't get any simpler than this, guys. I'm telling you, this is by far one of the best gift cards the friends have ever seen. Uh, yeah, once again, shout out to Joseph and Aaron. So Loss is going to pull up his vehicle right here that he's going to be handing over to me. 
and I'm gonna go ahead and hop into it once he gets out. There we go, I'm gonna hop in, and right away I should get the full alert, as you can see right here. Boom, for full alert, I'm gonna go ahead and accept it, and I can drive into my facility, and there we go, okay? Now, I wanted to keep going uh, on this footage for a little bit. It's still gonna be a pretty short video compared to my other ones, but yeah, I'm gonna overwrite this RH8 that I have right there, select it, and there we go. So look what happens when I drive the vehicle out though. I wanted to make sure because maybe some people weren't doing the facility gift cards to friends back in the day. Well, not back in the day, maybe like a month ago or two, uh, back when we were doing these a lot. But when you drive this vehicle out, it actually bricks on you, okay? And you're gonna see what happens right here. So I'm gonna get in the vehicle and I'm actually gonna go ahead and drive it out. When you drive it out, it's gonna automatically kick you out of the car and you see now I can't actually get back in it. That is because it's bricked. To actually avoid this, if you wanna stay unpatched, I recommend just going to swap character, swap to your second character, and then come back and swap to your first, all right? And then you'll be able to drive the cars. The other way is to actually close your game and come back, but I don't recommend doing that. But I just wanted to show you right here where the jerry can is. So you see I have jerry can ammo. That's where you wanna fill it up before it actually empties out completely, okay? But that's the glitch, guys, mad easy. That's going to be it for me, guys. My name is Roll Easy. Make sure to subscribe to the channel by hitting that big red button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Peace out, everybody, and happy glitching.